After a memorable night in Moffat, we literally crossed the country today. We move from the centre and go north towards Edinburgh, where we'll cross the Forth, head up through Dunfermline, and our resting place tonight will be Kinross. Just like cyclists, Scottish sheep can't be too sure of the weather, even in mid-June. Uh, but these guys are off to be sheared tomorrow morning, losing their winter coats, something a bit uh, cooler. We have stopped at the Leadburn Inn for lunch, just uh, about 10 miles shy of Edinburgh, and we'll be pushing on to the Scottish capital this afternoon. So a great ride this morning over Moffat, beautiful scenery, and we reach Edinburgh in the sunshine. First time we've seen the sun for a few days. It's quite pleasant and warm here in the Scottish capital. Uh, we'll be pushing across the fourth bridge this afternoon and then up to Kinross a little later. here in the middle of the construction of the new fourth bridge. Quite an undertaking, but credit to the uh, construction company, they've managed to keep it that cyclists and pedestrians can still navigate their way through a minefield of uh, roadworks, barriers, still keeping the cycle paths open, which is what we want. We've pushed 82 miles, mainly north and little east today. Uh, this morning giving us some of the best riding we've seen so far. This afternoon we've safely navigated uh, Edinburgh, though our first minor casualty as uh, Stuart uh, tested the appalling Scottish roads for us. Just a scratch, all on the men now, and we navigated the new fourth bridge and pushed on to Kinross, our final uh, resting place this evening, picturesque little place. Uh, a few tired legs, uh, they tell us it's going to be more hilly tomorrow. Let's see. 